Hello, this is Voodoo Denny here. I've got a Ford F-150 with a bad alternator. Before it was a bad alternator, I'm replacing it right now. Uh, it would crank up, run a little while, wherever I went to, if I'd stopped, turned the motor off, it wouldn't start again. So I've done a few things to it, uh, like replace the solenoid. Um, there's other things, but now I'm uh, going to replace the crank sensor. Um, maybe I'm thinking it might heat up and have issues. I'm not sure, but I'm going to replace it anyway. I found out where it was, and also I found that there weren't many, if any, videos on YouTube about this repair. So you don't have to take off any compressors. You don't have to remove the air uh, vent. It's um, right behind the the crank pulley. It's kind of difficult to get to. Um, I did it without doing anything other than leaving the serpentine belt off. And, uh, sorry for my video skills, but uh, I showed you the crank shaft sensor earlier and uh, it goes Oh, there it is. You can see those. Can you see those holes? I'll come back here. Yeah, right in there. See the shiny holes? It goes up in there. So I got a quarter inch wrench with a little extension and an eight millimeter socket. And that extension. And I went up in there and pulled it out. Anyway, it is possible. I didn't even jack the truck up.